Hello, everyone. It's Mr. Gaming Guitarist, and I am here to say that the Xbox One, for the first time ever, has outsold the PlayStation 4. And I think I know the number one contributor, or two of them, it all has to do with the discount, and they're trying to be very competitive, and so, of course, the normal price currently for an Xbox One is $399, but they started by giving off a $50 discount from now until January, but then for Black Friday, they reduced the price even further down to $300. $29 for the Assassin's Creed bundle, and clearly the strategy has worked, and currently I'm an idiot for not wanting to get the 329 deal, because, of course, you know me, I'm not uh, one of these stupid fucking fanboys that wants to see one, com one company fail over the other. I'm a I actually care, because when two of them are... when Nintendo, Microsoft, Sony, when all of them are all competing with each other, the consumer wins. The consumer gets the best out of everything. So, yeah, this is my thoughts on it. Uh, congratulations, Microsoft. You, you finally did something that makes us happy. And, uh, but, so, I want to end off this video by simply saying this. Do you think, so, oh, this deal where Xbox One is currently 349 this deal supposedly ends on January 2nd. Do you think that on January 3rd, after the 349 special ends, do you think Microsoft is going to raise the price up to $399? Or do you think it's going to stay at 349 They would be idiots to raise it to back to 399 but um, if they are smart, I would say they would keep it at 349 uh, and maybe Sony will respond. So, yeah, I will see you next time. And, uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And uh, I don't want to see any goddamn fanboys because I'll just delete your comments immediately. So I want actual people with brains. <laughs> So that's it. Uh, please like this video if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. Uh, please subscribe to my videos to support my channel. I would appreciate it, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.